me in with them, and I'm like not even on. But I love that we get to be <laughs> yeah. this trio. I'm Us very three, honored. Though, I'm gonna. I'm, we're dinosaurs in the best way. <laughs> yeah. We're um, cockroaches. You said once. <laughs> we're, we're hot pink cockroaches with glitter, and we're not going anywhere. We're not, and we've all been canceled so many times. Yeah. So many scandals. But you and Shane. This is the other thing. How have you? Because Shane too. Oh my God. How did you guys become so loved? Because you guys were um. Well, uh, we haven't told this story on the podcast. I know because I was blocked. You had blocked me, which I yeah. I love Jeffrey. I've learned to love this about him. Yeah. He will block anybody and doesn't care. And Shane said the same yeah. thing. He was talking about someone that you blocked, and he's just like, I wish I could be that person that could just block and not give a Here's shit. Here's the thing: today, in in today, in this week, if I block someone, it's like a news story. Right. And I get it. I gotta be fully real. You know me. I see every side. I'm a business owner. Right. I am right. I, right. I want a huge cosmetics company now. I'm not just some kid online that's popping off and running his mouth to mm-hmm. everyone. Right. So. It's you have to find the, the the line, the thin line of like, I, I am an owner, but sometimes people can be really mean. And this this business, you know, Jeffree Star Cosmetics, it's, it's my name, it's my baby. I wake up every day, like just hungry to create and grow this brand. Yeah. So what happened was a week ago, someone really tried me. Um, and <laughs> wait, what is this? I don't know about. Is it a scandal or just somebody? It's kind like of. An a, individual? But, see, but here's the thing. Don't you hate when you just you'll, you'll tweet someone. Okay. Just a random stranger that says something mean, and and maybe you're like, you, it doesn't matter what happens, mm-hmm. right? All right we're, we just both bought a new house, we moved, but it doesn't mean you can't have a moment of weakness or be angry for an hour and say something to someone, and then it's like a headline. Of course, of course, yeah. Like the old days, you just write something like, "Girl, shut the fuck up," yeah. and, like, and that was that. And no one cared, and no right. one talked about it. But if you write one person, it turns into a, you're, you know, your bully attacks. Yeah. Oh. Like, I'm like, girl, oh my yeah. God. You tell someone to be quiet and it's like, attacked the customer. And I'm like. But people can say a million th- things. Because you're also a human. Like, you're also a person. But people forget. Like, I think they do forget that we're, that we're people sometimes. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it's like, Ugh. But I get it. I mean, I was in the wrong. I actually reached out to the person and apologized. Can you say what happened? Um, or is it like. Yeah, no, okay. I mean, it's already, it's everywhere. Just like, basically someone was just like, kind of coming for me a little bit. And I misunderstood what they said. Oh. And it's about, because right now, like, with the Shane and the shipping thing, like, there's just a lot of craziness. Oh, gosh. You know what I mean? So yeah. someone just said something like annoying, and I was like, "Girl, you're being your attitude is being a little disgusting and gross." So it's like Jeffrey called someone disgusting, and I'm like, "Oh, oh gosh. my god!" I just meanwhile people say the worst things. I see comments people can say the worst things to you, and if you say one the thing, the darkest bad. stuff to yeah. me every hour, same to you, same yeah. Me. And it's just like get over it. Yeah. You signed up for it. They, yeah. I'm and like, they think, so yeah. I can't ever respond? Okay, cool. Got it. But I love that you do. Can I say it? I'm glad that you still See, Shane won't, won't do it. No. That's why I like, so I blocked her for a day and yeah. I blocked her the next day. But everyone's like, Jeffrey blocks customers. See, it's that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it turns out, it's like, no, it was one girl for five hours and we're good now. But yeah. But it turned into a, I'm the devil. I, Which is, of all your controversies, that's, that's the it. most viable. <laughs> yeah, that's oh very, God. very minimal. Oh, we're talking about controversies? Yes. I need a hit. <laughs> okay, yes. Ready to go? Oh, ASMR for the podcast. Yes, ASMR for the podcast. Ooh, you're so good at that. Hi. You're. So- I just had five guys score inside me. <laughs> and we can, we can be marked as Sorry, explicit my, right my away. My fantasy. My fantasy. Five guys score inside you. Yeah. I don't know if that's possible. Um. Is if you, it? If you have an hour. <laughs> Do you have to just be really stretched so five fit in at one time or no. different times? Oh, I can only. I've only fit two. At once. Yeah. And that took a minute. Shut up. This is yeah. what I love about you. See, I... I re- we go from entrepreneurship to full anal. But I love Sorry. that about you. You will talk about, like, <laughs> sucking dick in the shower. Because I... So I started back into, like, adult, like, some stuff, like, masturbation stuff. And people are really judgmental. They're like, okay, so she must need money, all that stuff. But it's like... Why can't you... But why can't you do that and make money and have fun? Why does right. it have to be you're desperate to, and make yeah, money? Yeah, I was like... Why like, does it have to be I a like, negative? Yeah, and I like talking about sex and stuff. And yeah. you're the only other person I feel on YouTube that has... You have this huge brand, I'm huge so company. Open. Like, I'm, yeah. I'm in love, but I'm in a relationship where we both, you know, have fun sometimes. Talk about and threesomes. We, yeah. You said you had five at once? Before with- Nate, yeah. Oh, but not, so with him, you only not have three. Not five, yeah. Oh, <laughs> that's a, you have a big enough bed for it. I, oh, the new bed? So, so the pink bed is in a guest room now. There's a pink suite. So if you come over, oh. you'll have a full pink Jeffrey moment. Oh my God, I love that. But my new bedroom, no one's seen it yet. All black velvet, <gasps> gold and white. It's a whole new vibe. Hot. It's like, it's sick. It's like a sex dungeon. Oh, uh, it's so Is it good. big? Is it as big the, as your other bed? The new bed, well, Madison just ordered it. It's 10 feet long and nine feet, um... Wide. So you could have like a sex party there. You never have sex parties though, do you? No, I've only gone to them. Like the ones on Craigslist okay. where you just show up and a bunch of guys. And, and Is that still around? Uh huh. Oh my god. I loved Craigslist. I used to do the fifty roses. Yeah. Do you remember? I used to do one hundred and fifty roses. Oh. <laughs> this is why you're wearing your oh hat and I'm god. still here. Thank you. I'm slowly coming up behind you. 
like 150 roses. Wow. Yeah. Why and the first blushing? series. No, the first series you talked about it, which I, I thought was really yeah. interesting. And I love that you're still very open about being yeah. open and sexual and stuff like that. Because people can't imagine, because oh, they just see us now. They right. see the success, the cars, the money, the clothes. But it's like, no, I was literally in a, in a two bedroom for eight years, like sucking dick for money. I had tax evasion. Wow. I was hiding from the government. I've been through some things. Yeah. And so to flip it all and have an 800 credit score and a black card and a new house and like all this shit, which that that's not all, you know, that doesn't, it was just personal goals. Yeah. Well. When you like come I from nothing. I literally couldn't use my own checking account for years and I had to go through my record it's label frozen. LLC because it was all frozen. And it's like now, of course I'm not embarrassed, but I was so embarrassed back then. Right. Faking it and like, you know, buying a one Louis bag a month to look cute on yeah. on my space and I was really starving. Yeah. That's what people don't know. Keeping up know. the appearances and that's a lot of people. Yes. That and, is a lot that, of YouTubers. And in even not even YouTubers in like in my old neighborhood. Half the neighbors were all the cars released and they're all broke. And yeah. I'm like, but I didn't know that. When I moved in, I'm like, oh my god, everyone's oh. healthy. Like I'm the weird white and white trash. Right. And I'm like, oh, it's all smoke and mirrors. It's all smoke and mirrors. This city is all I'm very open about that too, because I I definitely people always say, You're so rich, Trish. And I'm like, honestly, I spend what I make. And I like yeah. I definitely have like a little savings, but not where it should be. Yeah. <laughs> if I I could have a fourteen million dollar house if I was smart, but instead yeah. I'm like, you know, and I do okay, but for sure I spend I spend what I make and yeah. I'm very open and I'm like, that's not necessarily a good thing, but it's like the reality. Don't look at me and be like, Oh, Trish is so rich and balling. It's like I'm not. I literally am spending what I yes. make, you know. We're, we're gonna have a business class yeah I, well yeah. i get screwed over a lot we talked about this and like you have too so that's why i like that's why i love jeffrey because he is like even though we're like all the same and shane too you guys are very much like mentors and it's inspirations because yeah. you were like you did have a lot of scandal and like this year was the one of everyone was canceling trish and i told shane this too like you guys literally saved me by naming just a, a shadow yes after me, oh which, my and 